的，喏，就给大家保起色。对啊，我以为是谁在龙。Tiene las agallas de acercarse y qué? La bondad, la I'm still trying to make sense of this very strange video that's going viral all over Indonesia. Apparently, a bunch of people were inside of a bus. When the bus driver noticed something strange, he stops the bus. And here you go, see that? They're saying that this is a dark shadow, a ghost, or some sort of demon. And when people noticed it, they freaked out. Check this out. What the heck was that? People are freaking out about it. After being posted, a lot of people are saying that this most likely is a jinn, a demon, or maybe some sort of skinwalker creature. But I don't see why people are freaking out that much about a monkey or something like that. I'm gonna show you guys in slow motion, pay very close attention. You can see the bus driver over here. And then this thing over here, and then it swooshes really quick back into the mountains. This is when people see it and freak out. What the heck is going on here, guys? I want to know your thoughts. What is your take? The following video was submitted by Little Fatima, who writes that a family in Indonesia had caught something unexplainable on camera. It goes without saying, but what this family had caught on tape is pretty disturbing. The video shows what appears to be a family gathering taking place inside someone's house, when all of a sudden, something very unusual is seen in the background. Take a look.
there appears to be someone or something hiding away from the family gathering. But the appearance of whoever or whatever this is, is very uncanny. Now, it could be that someone's reflection is being shown in the footage, but upon closer examination, the figure doesn't appear to be anyone's reflection. If that's not creepy, then I don't know what is. As always, you're more than welcome to share your thoughts on this footage. What exactly had been caught on camera? The Follower while a man was vacationing in the Rocky Mountains, his girlfriend zoomed in and snapped an iPhone Live photo of him. For those who don't know, an iPhone Live photo basically captures a three second video along with the normal photo. Later, when they were reviewing their pictures, they found something very odd. Even though they were all alone in the wilderness that day, someone appeared to be watching the man from the field behind him. On first glance, it looks like someone standing in tall grass. But as this shot shows, the grass in that area is not that tall. So on second look at the photo, it almost appears as if the person was actually hiding in the grass. But the iPhone Live Photo 3 second video shows something very different. It almost looks like someone walking, even though half of the person's body would be beneath the ground. When the video is motion stabilized, it looks even creepier. A salesman, who is staying at a hotel, captures footage of something pretty creepy. The following footage comes from a salesman who is traveling overseas for a business trip. Due to travel restrictions, the salesman had to self-quarantine for a total of seven days. His self-quarantine took place at a hotel where he booked a room all for himself. But, during the seven days that he's there, something really creepy happens. On the second night of his quarantine, the salesman is talking to a friend via webcam when all of a sudden this happens. The conversation between the two then segues on the topic of food served at the hotel, but as they continue to talk, something startles the salesman. Oh, uh. アジア料理多いね、やっぱ。うん。また聞こえたね。また。うん。すいません、僕は知るまだ。え、何してんの?え、その強盗とかだったらやばいんじゃない?ま、ショックショックとね。ま、ショック。Oh no. No, 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 no. Oh, mommy. What is this? Oh, mommy. What is this? Oh, mommy. What is this? Oh, mommy's a bad one. Oh, God. Have you ever wondered what lies beneath Antarctica? 
Believe it or not, this question occupies many human minds. For a long time, especially with the ban on flying or approaching those areas. There are some theories, including what came out recently, that explains some of the accusations against the government and the activities it carries out there. Some believe that there is an ancient, advanced civilizations that live underground, and the government is secretly aware of them, including politicians and scientists who organized missions to explore underground cities. While mainstream scientists discredit these notions, Believers see anomalies in some satellite images that shows a giant hole in the ice and historical records as a proof of advanced hidden civilization. And what supports this theory is a satellite images that have captured pyramid-like formations beneath the ice. Some enthusiasts suggest these could be remnants of an advanced ancient civilization that existed long before our recorded history. What do you think? When it comes to videos of baby monitors that capture something paranormal on camera, they usually tend to be creepy. But this next video may just be a lot more wholesome than scary. Whitney Allen is the mother of two children whose father tragically passed away in 2022 after suffering a brain injury caused by a bee sting. Apparently, Whitney's husband was severely allergic to bees. The bee sting he received was enough to send his body into cardiac arrest and affect his brain. After months of being in hospice care, he sadly passed away. To Whitney, the passing of her husband was extremely agonizing, but for him to pass away only three months later after the birth of their second child was painfully devastating. The fact that he wasn't able to stay for long to see their child grow up was unbearable to think about. Now even though she feels that her husband wasn't able to meet their baby in a meaningful way on earth, she believes that he was able to do so from the beyond. Late one evening, Whitney is looking over at the baby monitor when she sees a mysterious light on her child's head. At first, she thought this light was just a reflection on the screen, but when her child changed position on the bed, the light was still there. She couldn't help but think that this orb was actually her husband, as it seemed to be patting and stroking the baby's head. After months of experiencing total agony, seeing this had brought Whitney a sense of peace. Even though her husband had passed away, she takes comfort in the thought that somehow he's still here. As with most videos, feel free to let me know your thoughts on this one 